We are here at International Primate Protection League, located in Somerville, South Carolina. This grassroots nonprofit organization was founded by conservationist Dr. Shirley McReel in 1973. Over the years, International Primate Protection League has been dedicated to battling the illegal trafficking and abuse of primates all across the world. Their headquarters are a home and safe haven to 30 retired gibbons who have been rescued from many different situations, such as illegal pet trafficking, being experimented on in laboratories, or zoos that can no longer take care of them, and they're no longer able to return to the wild. Today, help them celebrate International Gibbon Day by following the donation link at the end of this video, or check out their online merchandise shop, where you can get cool shirts like these. Every t-shirt purchased or donation made, big or small, helps take care of the gibbons that call IPPL home, as well as continuing the conservation fight for gibbons across the world. Sometimes the gibbons go up in these towers and just kind of shake like you still have the gibbons. Oh, really? So I try and fight the thorns. Recognized species of gibbons throughout the rainforest of southern and southeast Asia. Um, and here at IPPL, they are home to large gibbons, or otherwise commonly known as white handed gibbons. Gibbons are not actually monkeys, but rather lesser apes. And the difference between apes and monkeys is apes don't have tails. All of the lesser apes, as are consisted pretty much all of gibbons um, and the greater apes such as your chimps, bonobos, gorillas and orangutans are the greater apes and the difference between them is pretty much primarily size. Gibbons are uh, very vocal primates, um, and their calls are accurately called songs. Uh, <laughs> and it, each species has variations in their tone and pitch, um, and it kind of creates sort of uh, an accent across species to species. Very vocal. Once one starts going, they kind of feed off each other and get all each other all going all at the same time before you know the whole sanctuary is all going at the same time. them with life up in the treetops, nature's equipped them with comically long arms and specialized hook-shaped hands allowing them to swing from uh, tree branch to tree branch. Uh, they can swing distances up to about 50 feet. This movement is called brachiating and this skill has allowed them to become the fastest ape um, and they can move I believe at speeds up to about 34 miles per hour which is faster than a racehorse.
that they can move from enclosure to enclosure here, giving a lot more space than what they would normally have, and they definitely <laughs> utilize them. Really? 